Well, it might have been a little cool today, but at least we saw a break in the rain, although there were showers last night. Overnight, Owen, Swan Hill and Daniloquin all had a low of nine. Kerrang, eight. Chuka, 11. Shepherd and Donald and Bendigo, eight. Maryborough, five. Castlemaine and Seymour, six. Ballarat, three degrees. Today, Owen reached 19. Swan Hill, Daniloquin, Kerrang and Chuka all 18. Shepherd and Donald, 17. Bendigo and Maryborough, 16. Castlemaine, 15. Seymour, 16. And Ballarat, 13 degrees. Looking at the chart, and the cold front which passed through Victoria overnight brought us some more rain during the early hours of the morning. It moved through fairly rapidly and another cold front following should not have much influence on our weather. It should slip away to the southeast. There is a large anticyclone approaching from the west which should bring us some fine and warm conditions for the rest of the week and give the farmers a chance to bale some of that hay. The forecast for all areas cool to mild with moderate southwesterly winds. Temperature ranges, Bendigo 7 to 20, Swan Hill and Shepparton 7 to 21 and Ballarat 7 to 15. The outlook for Thursday, fine and mild, for Friday, mild to warm and for Saturday, continuing warm. Currently at the studios, it's 12 degrees and the barometer reads 1,008 hectopascals and rising. The build-up to Bendigo's biggest race day of the year has started. The champagne flowed at the Bendigo race course today and this year's cup fashions went on show. When singer Noel Watson agreed to perform at the annual Miradong Champagne and Turkey Luncheon, he thought at least a few blokes would turn up for moral support. Instead, he was alone among 400 women. But then Noel wasn't the main attraction. That was reserved for the catwalks. What's in for the Bendigo Cup this year is vibrant colours. Hats should be basic straw with a bright scarf. And sunglasses have moved from an accessory to a necessity. After absorbing all that culture in one hit, Noel Watson made his fashion statement. Well, if they've got any sense, I'll uh, wear T-shirts and shorts and thongs because I think uh, the rain might stop and it could come out warm and uh, that's what I'd go for. Well, that's all from the news desk for tonight. Before we go recapping our top story, a 49-year-old woman is in Bendigo Base Hospital with serious injuries after a collision between a sports car and a truck and 20 textile workers at Perfect Fit in Bendigo have been retrenched, and company management says there may be more. Stand by now for National News on the from Melbourne. I'll be back later in the evening with a news update. From all of us, good night.